Sister Asma from Canada in the previous segment called in and she asked about using the credit cards for uh, or possessing them for necessary reasons. It is obvious that those who live in the West, in order to go around, in order to rent a car or buy a plane ticket or order whatever or pay the phone bills, you know, they require to have um, a credit card, at least one. But when you say that for renting a flat to live in, I don't think you require to have a credit card. They do have a credit check, but it is not based on the credit uh, card. Why is a sister asking about uh, holding a credit card and whether it's permissible or not, and what would it do? Because in the credit card, there is a clause that if you fail to make the payment 45 days from the day of the due date or I'm sorry from the day that the bill is issued then you have to pay interest and this interest is known that it is riba and when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forbade riba he did not only forbid people from charging people interest but only but also paying la'ana Allah riba akilahu wa mu'kilahu wa katibahu wa shahidai so she has the right to have this concern and Muslims really have to be concerned about that but because of the fatawa committees saying that this is a necessity provided you know that this is not permissible to have it in the first place except for the fact that you have to have it to fulfill your needs and when you make the charges you pay on time to avoid paying interest because by the way brothers and sisters mere agreeing to the interest payment even if you did not do it is a sin and that's why she's concerned and, and I really applaud that but if you cannot live without it and you have to have one and you get it and you use it then make sure that to make the payment soon once the bill is issued it would be best if you can direct the payment towards your bank account so that it will have a direct withdrawal from your bank account and in this case you don't worry about the late payment. Jazakumullahu khairan sister Asma, may Allah bless you.